so and slowly creeping upon us. Uh, there's been teasers, there's been the pick 10, uh, the perk patches, which look modern. Everybody thinks it's going to be modern. In a perfect world, I hope it's uh, around the Black Ops 2 era, of course, because I, like, I, I just love Black Ops 2. Anyway, you're seeing some TDM gameplay on uh, Aquarium, duh. And I, I really go off this game. I got my HUD. It's gonna look clean gameplay. I can't talk when I'm playing. So we're in theater mode right now. Anyways, so Black Ops 4, it's currently May 5th. There's less Fire than two snuff. weeks until... Uh, in here. Okay, I think everything's good. I was trying to make sure it was running okay. It looks like it's running good. So yeah, Black Ops 4's big reveal is less than two weeks away. And I know I'm not posting too much, trying to get better at it, trying to find free time. Uh, luckily, I didn't work today. My boss just told me have the day off. We, we don't really have any work. So that's a good thing. So... I have time to sit back, relax, play some Black Ops 3. I'm nine wins away from getting one of my triple plays. And I just decided, I've been Prestige 8 level 55 for a while, and I was like, ah, I'm gonna go ahead and Prestige. Uh, I'd like to get to Prestige 10, or at least touch Prestige Master before, that was ridiculous, I had to reload. Um, before Black Ops 4 releases, which is only in October, that's that's five. Yeah, we're we're like five months away, five months and a week from Black Ops 4 coming out. It's insane. This feels like it was so far away, but it's it's just slowly creeping up. We've got uh, the rest of May, June, July, August, September. And then October, a couple weeks into October, it's going to be out. And I'll probably do some more zombies content. I mean, I was burnt out on zombies for a while. So I, I just kind of stopped playing it. Uh, I've been playing other things like Far Cry 5. I've been playing... And I've covered this before. I love World War II pretty much just exclusively for the war game mode. If you haven't tried the war game mode in World War II, and you have it, definitely jump in there. You get a lot of XP. It's really fun. You can go on feeds. You can protect objectives. It feels like you're in an actual war. It's, it's really Sledgehammer's best work, in my opinion. And I've, I hated Advanced Warfare. World War II, it's, it's okay to me. Uh, but their war game mode definitely stands out. I mean, huge, huge shout out to Sledgehammer for making that awesome game mode. I just unlocked the Sten not long ago. And, uh, I'm kind of getting sloppy at commentaries. I mean, I, I wasn't the greatest before, but I've just been on such a long hiatus from YouTube. It's it's kind of weird. It, ta it takes some getting used to again yeah I'm I'm kind of being a jackass in this game using the haymaker but I think end of the game I ended ended up going 30 and and 10 I believe so I, I really just mowed them down with this gun they've they've really buffed it to where it can at least compete with the Brecky KRM and Argus I mean all the shotguns are really good in this game if you know how to put the right attachments and use them correctly. I mean, not even that. I mean, you put a shotgun with no attachments and you play right, you're going to shred. But right now, Operation Swarm is live. Uh, I know they put the RPK and the Sten in the game, which I'm really excited for, but at the same time, even with triple play contracts, there's like a really slim chance you get them. 
back in December whenever we did that community event, I was really happy because I got the KVK-99, aka the uh, AN-94, and the ballistic knife in the same supply drop. It was awesome. Uh, last triple play I did, I got the stupid the the buzz saw, which was fun to use for a few games, but it's like I I want a gun I could just wreck people with, like go on streaks with. Like I'm uh, out of this triple play, I'm hoping to get either the peacekeeper or the what you call it. I've got the XMC on Xbox, so and that's the good thing about having it on both systems. Uh, because of season pass rewards and community events and multiple accounts, you, you kind of get to try everything um, unless you get duplicates on different accounts. But I have, I know I have the XMC and M16 on Xbox One, and then I've got the N94 and quite a bit of other weapons on this one. Spear blunted. Stop that guy in his tracks with his gravity spikes. I don't think so, buddy. And it's just, this game is amazing. Just the supply drop system sucks. Like to me, that's really its only issue. Like I, their supply drop system is terrible. I think it's as bad, if not worse, than Advanced Warfare's. I mean, I think, you know, you see those videos. People spend hundreds of dollars for a single weapon. I remember when they were first purchasable. I think this one guy spent like $400 just to get the wrench. That's a kill. And it kind of turned into a meme almost, but it's like, really? Of course, if you have disposable income, your money, do whatever you want with it. But I'm kind of straying off topic, talking about Black Ops 3. This game's three years old, everybody wants to hear about Black Ops 4 which there's not a whole lot to talk about really because we haven't got the reveal yet uh, we don't know anything confirmed about zombies yeah I went 31 and 10 and I mean the, there's really nothing left to talk about until the big reveal which unfortunately I'm going to be working that day however uh, when I get home maybe I'll see if I can jump on the computer, make a video. I don't know where my Elgato is, so it's it's kind of hard to make a professional commentary. Uh, I know I, I could get better editing skills and all that. I'm going to be making an intro, a new one, within the next few weeks. I've had that old one forever. And... Other than that, I, I, I'm just rambling at this point, so hope you enjoyed the video. Everyone have a great Saturday. Oh, and uh, if, if you've been hiding in a bush, Prop Hunt is now available in Black Ops 3, and it's it's different, that's for sure. Uh, it, it's not bad, it's, it's pretty fun. But... Alright, I will see you guys later. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment down below.